I'm finally free. Eight days off. Though you're very dear to me, I have to leave you for a while. Wait a minute. The math teacher gave us 500 equations to solve. I have two projects to finish. And I'm not even done with writing half of the lessons I have this semester. What's more, the Arabic teacher asks us to read a 500 page book. School, a paradise on earth. You know, without school, I wouldn't be the person I am today. It saved my life. If I had the choice between being at home or being at school, I wouldn't hesitate to choose the second one. I love it. When it's summer, I really miss it. I can't wait for the weekends to end so I can finally go back to my friends and teachers. These words were said by literally no person ever. Just try to understand this. How is it possible to be given too much homework during a so-called holiday, which is supposed to be a break, not a burden? This doesn't mean I'm ungrateful. Of course, it is thanks to school that our country has noticeably progressed in various fields. Yet parents still feel that there's something missing in our educational system. We all know that more efforts and sacrifices are needed in this world. A world where no one dares say how it will end the next day. A world where results are more important than means. A world where students are asked to get the best mark, be at the top of their class. But I never ask what they've grasped or learned. Sure, we can solve equations, learn about the history of the First World War and the Second one, and of course forget about it the next year, or the following test. Worst of all, we recite parts of the Quran without having a clear idea about its meaning. <laughs> Let me tell you about Zainab's story. Zainab couldn't recite some verses of the Quran and was given as zero. The students protested and said, just by witnessing that there is no God but Allah and that Muhammad is his prophet, you should have at least given me 10 out of 20, not a zero. Poor Zainab. Do you have any idea? Why students are asked to learn some lessons by heart? Is it just for tests? Us students are not convinced of this fact, since our memory is empty the minute we finish our tests and get our marks back. It should be done in another way. For example, why not debating, preparing documentaries, in brief, doing it, but choosing our own way and being responsible of our choices. Talking about school, let me ask you a really controversial question. Does school really help students mentally, emotionally? And some of you will be like, but isn't that a therapist's job? Why do you care? I do care, because I am a student. I know what it's like going home every day thinking you'll never be enough. You'll never be at your parents' expectations. Picture this. A mark that can open the doors of all hells. It can be a good one. Still not the best for my dad. It's time to let us believe in ourselves. Get rid of any complex of inferiority because you can't pour from an empty cup. 80% of students in my school can't even raise their hands to speak. They can't talk in front of people. And you ask yourself why they don't, why you do nothing? If school can't help them, who will? I want a school that truly feels like home, to be happy while preparing for my future. I want to see everyone around me excited to learn and reach for their dreams. A school that cares about this and this, as much as it cares about this. Albert Einstein once said, everyone's a genius, but if you judge a fish by its ability to climb a tree, it will live its whole life believing it is stupid. Please, stop comparing us to others. Instead, let us know how to make it possible so that all students can have the same opportunity I have right now. Let them speak up, talk about things that matter. Let them be the voices of their own generations, because they matter. Life is like a book that never ends. Chapters close. But not the book itself. So let's make sure the next chapter is entitled Change. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Leah.
Thank you. Thank you very much, Kenya. And good luck. Thanks so much.